Hello once again, my name is Murph and welcome to this new video on Need for Speed World. Now, I know what you're thinking, Need for Speed World was taken down in 2014, but this is actually a new unofficial server where you can play World online with your friends. And this is going to be a tutorial teaching you how to make a lot of money in this game. So yeah, the thumbnail wasn't clickbait. Anyway, if you're willing to take my word for it, the fastest way is the Fortuna Pursuit event. Now, if you don't want to listen to why and how it's the most efficient for making money, you can just click off right now and get straight to it. Um, but you might want to stay for another minute or two so I can explain some important things to make this a lot easier and quicker for you to do. I'll leave some timestamps for it because I'm going to be talking a lot. So before I do talk about it, I would like to say that I downloaded this game about four days ago, and that isn't a lot of time. Uh, yet I'm nearly level 25, which makes every car available to me. That includes the best S-Class cars. And uh, I've already bought quite a lot, um, so right now I actually have the Style 4 RX-7, the B-Spec MR2, Ford Shelby GT500 Super Snake, BMW M6 Coupe, A-Spec Renault Megane, B-Spec Nissan Fit. you get the point, I've got a lot of cars, okay? <laughs> so for someone who's played for much less than a week, um, that's quite a bit of money spent. So the way I got all my money is by repeating the Fortuna Pursuit over and over, and at first you might think that's complete rubbish, the Pursuits hardly give you any money. You're not wrong, but at the same time, you kind of are. Um, a good thing to note is that in this game, uh, sorry, in this unofficial server, the way you get money is actually dependent on your level. So if you're a higher level, you would get a lot more per race. So like say a level 20 would get twice the amount of money a level 10 would get for finishing a race. Um, and if you're a low level watching this, which is highly possible because you know, you're looking to find money, um, say like a level 5 for example, you're most likely getting a thousand or two thousand dollars each time you do the pursuit and that's that's nothing um, But if you're a, like a low level It doesn't really matter how much you make because the expensive cars that you need to grind for you can't get them anyway until you're about level 20 or 25 um, And even then this event is a great way to get XP to level up quickly and while you're grinding XP, you're also getting a truckload of cash, so there's, there's, it's just a win-win, basically. Um, when I first started this game, I, I asked a lot of people in free run what the fastest way to make money is, and nearly a lot of them, or sorry, nearly all of them, <laughs> um, suggested that I do huge circuits, which like, you know, Country Club or Hastings, for example. Um, the problem with that is circuits take quite a long time to do, and while they pay a lot more money than a pursuit does, it took me nearly, like, eight minutes to complete Hastings, it, well like once in my Super Snake, um, and that, that really doesn't pay much. It pay, I got around 30,000 every time I did two laps, and that is terrible when you can get 100,000 repeating the pursuit over and over. And again, you don't make as much money as someone who is a higher level, I'm level 20, 24, 25, I'm getting to level 25, so I'm gonna get a lot more money than a lower level player. Um, but like I said, you, you get the cars when you level up, so you're gonna need to do that first anyway. So what's so special about the pursuit? Um, well, as you can see from this image I am now showing on the screen, it is possible to finish this event in less than 10 seconds. So it's, it's well actually it's really hard to do. Um, you'll find that on average it'll take about 15 to 20 seconds to complete it. Um, but since I am level, level 24, I get about 20,000 each time. Um, and that's only with the, the two three-star bounty hunter perks. Um, these perks increase the amount of money I earn from pursuits by 30%. Um, but like I was saying, it takes around 10 seconds to do this if you're lucky. What you want to do is use the juggernaut. I'll explain how you do this in a second, but you, you got to be lucky. And the second police car has to stay still in the junction for you to hit it and, and take it out. Um, and that way you, you get a, f a faster finish like I did. But it's, it's very uncommon for it to do that. So in order to finish this quickly, what you want to do is start the event drive straight ahead, make a lift, and then immediately turn right into the parking garage. Um, hide in the corner, and then once you're in cooldown, you can use the instant cooldown skill. Um, in this server, those those skills are actually unlimited. You get 100 every time you do a race. They refresh every time you, you go in or out of the, the safe house or in and out of a, uh, an event. So you get, you get infinite of those skills, so you don't need to worry about that. Um, but yeah, once you've done that, you can just repeat the process. And um, it's a very boring and tedious way to make money, but I find that it could be made interesting by challenging yourself to do it as fast as possible. I'll even give you a challenge to beat my best time, as seen before, of 8.91 seconds. So if you can beat that, let me know in the comments. I'll be pretty proud of you, to be honest, because that's a pretty good time. <laughs> 
Um, yeah, I hope this guide has been useful to you, and um, yeah, maybe I'll see you around in-game. Peace.